the 2021 season will definitely not be forgotten soon. Each and every day, the excitement on the track keeps getting better and better. In the midst of this excitement are the female sprinters, who have taken things to another level. History is being made every time they touch the track. And field, too. Don't forget Yulimar Rojas is threading a world world record every time she touches the runway. Another lady who seems to be a major threat each time she touches the track is Sharika Jackson. Sharika Jackson's shocking performances at the Jamaican National Trials put the entire women's sprint at the Olympics in disarray because what was said to already be very tight competition got way worse. Following those performances, you'd think she couldn't do anything more to make the Olympics even more exciting, but she somehow managed to do so. On July 6th, approximately 48 hours after her 200-meter race in Stockholm, Sweden, Jackson had to travel over 1,200 miles for another race in Hungary. This time, she had a much tougher field. The likes of Daphne Shippers and Shawnee miller Weibo were there as well. miller Weibo is as tough as it gets in the 200 meter on the female side, being invincible since that 2017 season. She had a 19-0 win streak, which saw the likes of Elaine Thompson, Shelly Ann, Daphne Shippers, and Shikari Richardson being beaten in that streak. This shows the level of dominance, because not even some of the world's fastest women could take her down in the event. Jackson, who knows what it's like to lose to the Bahamian, remained poised because her confidence was higher than ever. When the gun went, Jackson had one of the best starts in recent times, closing down quickly on the Bahamian in the lane ahead of her. By the end of the turn, the Jamaican was in front. This did not guarantee safety for the Jamaican because Weibo isn't known for having the fastest curves. So the race really began on the final straight. However, to everyone's surprise, Shawnee couldn't reel in Jackson, as she managed to do to other elite sprinters. Because this time, she was not facing someone with only speed, but with strength as well. Jackson cruised across the line to finish in first position, stopping the clock in 21.96 seconds. A brand new meeting record. This 21.96 means she is the only female this season to produce more than one sub-22 clockings in two separate meets which is a sign she could be the most legitimate of all the contenders heading to Tokyo. To think she has beaten the most dominant 200-meter sprinter on the circuit is sign enough she could be the one heading into the games with the most confidence. The race also proves that if Sharika Jackson gets a good start and is able to get off the curve before the other ladies in Tokyo, we will be seeing a brand new woman rating as Olympic champion.